I'm a union electrician who receives a W-2 and a 10 and I am from an electrical contractor that I work for. Should I move forward um, with the social security section? There's a couple of different ways that you can handle that. Um, if it were me, I know that union electricians can um, not work on a W-2 basis. They can work on a 1099 basis. And you can even have them pay your private foundation that we set up for you. Um, there's all kinds of ways that you can facilitate payment uh, for that. They do not need to pay the registered organization name, meaning your all caps name. They, they only have to pay um, and they get a full deduction. They don't have employment costs. They don't have insurance costs. They don't have any of that stuff. They get the full deduction like they were making a payment to anybody or any company. And they don't need to necessarily 1099, but they can 1099 your company, your foundation, and your foundation has no requirement to file a, a tax return or a business tax return because of the structure that it is. So that's the way that I would go forward. I wouldn't go forward. If you're trying to come out, I would try to limit the use of the social security period. I don't say that it completely um, negates your ability to use the social, but there's so many things that you have to do to make sure that you're operating the social security like filing the returns paying the tax um making the deductions uh and 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 filing that 1040 you got that big old section on the bottom that's it's that that's an oath and on the oath it says i am a taxpayer i am a u.s citizen and you're going to cross all those things out and you know why we had we've been teaching people to cross that stuff out for years out of all of the years um 12 years we've had one person get a frivolous filing fee and got some stupid fine and they're like who cares i'm out you know what are they going to do they can't take blood from a turnip you know what i mean uh when you are done with the irs you're done we're starting to really see receive letters from the irs and um uh regarding uh elements of what is a fiduciary what is the obligation what is needing to be done next and they're like nothing further on your account <clears throat> so it's it's a blessing it's a benefit there are ways out they have a revocation of election which means if you had an election there should be a revocation of election if you make a deposit you should be able to make a withdrawal it works that way at every county recorder at every bank um including every you know, the IRS, the SSA, the SSA has a provision to withdraw um, the, the voluntary nature of it. And they try to do everything they can to sneak around with the words and the wordplay and keep you from understanding your freedoms as, as a man. And so uh, it's the same thing with um, any contract. You know, they want you to think you can't cancel out of it. I'm going to tell you, you're a man. You can cancel out of anything, especially one ones that have fraud tied to them. Now they aren't technically contracts, they're even easier to cancel because they're self-executing uh, adhesion trusts. So what would make your ability not to be able to get out of it if it's self-executing? It means there's no offer, no acceptance, no consideration, no performance, no, no disclo full disclosure. That means there's no contract. So therefore, it's a trust. You're telling me I can't get off a trust? Once you realize that, the power of what we're doing at His Advocates and getting off of a trust by doing a new agreement where you're removing your signature as the trustee, as the surety, um, but you're leaving the contract in place for the registered organization, and we create a new agreement through an administrative process, fault them and default them, put that into the public and serve them. I'm telling you right now, it's the most powerful thing that you can do. And we do it for everybody. And it's very much so needed in this nation right now. People need to understand how important it is to come out. It's never before. I'm going to be grinding this home uh, for the next, uh, I don't know, however long I get to. <laughs>